Yo guys, what is going on? It is your boy Nick from Run the Foot Market. Uh, today I have a new video, guys. We're in a new kind of setup area, um, kind of back for the summer. So I have uh, two uploads probably today for you guys. Today's upload right now. I just want to get onto the market. I want to do some buying. I want to talk about some things with you guys. I want you guys to watch what I'm buying. I got. I want you guys to all see what I'm doing. Also, to start off the video, I'm at my La Liga pack for you guys. Um, and we'll do that. So we'll do that to start off the video. We'll talk about the impacts of the squad when you should sell certain investments. Now, if you guys enjoyed the video today, make sure you guys smash the like. If you guys are new on the channel, make sure you guys subscribe. We're growing like crazy. We're about to hit 64,000 subscribers, which to me is just mental. Um, so today is the day where you get your guaranteed La Liga player. Um, you need a team of the season card. You need an 84 rating. You need two La Liga players and you need 70 chemistry. So I would assume that a lot of the 84s and 85s are up. I got to see what I have in my club. I'm not really sure, to be honest, if I have everything I need. I may have to go buy some players. But what I would tell you is I told you all to pick up 85s. You know, I told you all to get in with 85s and things like that before team of the season started. And if you did that, you're definitely going to make some coins today. Um, and life's going to be easy for you. I, I don't really know how I'm going to pull out this squad. It might be... This might cost me a little bit of a little bit of cash. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this that easily, um, but we are gonna have the La Liga pack for you dudes today, um, and hopefully, 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 we can go ahead and uh, and pack something. That's obviously uh, the plan. That's what we want to do. So I'm praying to I'm praying to God that we do uh, we do end up getting some. I don't know how I'm gonna be. I'm gonna have to do something here. I, I think. Oh, you know what we're gonna do? I'm gonna I'm gonna resubmit this dude. Let me show you guys right now. So. I also want to tell you guys, I did about 70 of these La Liga packs, packed absolute shitters, nothing good, um, really, really, really uh, like terrible players, but we did get Lucas Hernandez, and I'm actually going to put him in this SBC because I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to pack him again this week, um, so I think for me, it's, it's, it's smart, and it's in my best interest for me to just use him in the SBC, that's going to give me my two La Liga players, Now I also just want to see what do I have in terms of La Liga players that I can just throw in here, I've got some 83s. Which for me is good because, guys, I'm going to be doing some of these packs this week. So, in my opinion, I'm going to be packing them again. So, I'm not too worried about those. Um, and then we're going to look at the market after this, boys. Don't you guys worry. Hang tight. We're going to check the market out. We're going to talk about what's going on with it. You know, some people might be a little bit confused. You guys might not know exactly what's happening. So, we're going to pop in there in a second. We need 70 chemistry. Gee. Yeah, that's kind of a huss. 70, 70 chem, yeah. What are we saying with that? Um, we're gonna have to check out if we got any other golds in the La Liga by the 82 rating, and if we do, we do have a Benega and we have this dude. So let me, let me, let me, let me see if I could, if I can move these two around, maybe get away with using an 81, and uh, and using Benega as my other 83. Let's get, uh, could Giovinco, is he gonna screw us with Chem? So he's not gonna screw us with Chem. Uh, I need to figure out. That's gonna be an 84 rating. I do need one more chem chemistry, uh, in the squad. Can any of these guys do it? He does it. Um, now at this point, am I, I'm, I'm cool submitting this squad for me. This is cool. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pack that Hernandez dude again. So I want to, I want to submit him into the SBC. Um, because at this point I already know I'm going to get him. I'm doing these packs all week for me, guys. I'm not expecting anything. I'm really thinking that I'm not going to get shit. Um, so I'm not, I'm not expecting anything from this SBC today. Um, and, and you know, if we get anything like, you know, I think right now what we're looking for is, uh, we're going to look for. Uh, we're looking for the Uruguay flag, and then we're looking for striker. Now, I'll show you guys before we do the pack uh, what I already have. Uh, I just submitted Lucas Hernandez because I think I'm going to pack him again this week. I picked up Saul last night. Uh, we, we got Saul. Oh, I also have... Is he in the squad? We do have him. So I have Busquets and Godin. So we don't want Saul, Godin, or Busquets. Don't want any of those three. At this point, anything else will take. I'll take a Rodrigo. I'll take something like that. Let's see the player, guys. I'm not going to keep you guys waiting any longer. Hopefully, we can get a big guy. I just don't want a duplicate, guys. That That's, for me, duplicates suck. So, we'll see who we get. We get, uh, is that Jan, that's Oblak. So, we get Jan Oblak in our pack. Um, to be honest, I've heard really bad things about him. So, not too happy with that. But I will use him uh, in the SBC down the line. I'll probably put him, actually, in an icon SBC. I'll probably put him in... Uh, uh ronaldo at some point down the line so i think I'll, I'll probably put him in ronaldo at some point down the line uh, i just started working on r9 so I'm, I'm assuming if we go into if you're to go into your club right now and you guys were to go check out what are some 85s 84s what are they doing right now 
um, I would say they're probably they're probably flying in value, right? So, you know, this was something I said at some point via La Liga or or uh, or uh, holy shit, is he? He's 25k. Wow. So I bought him as an investment at 14,000 coins, and now he's 25,000 coins. And these are the simple things you guys can do, just as investors and things like that, to make coins. This is very. Oh my god, is he 17k? Oh my gosh, he's 17k. Yeah, we're gonna take the money on some of these. We're gonna take the money on some of these. So he's 17k. How's my man Berkey doing? So Berkey, it looks like all the 84 rated. It looks like right now what I can see is that all these dudes are up in value. I want to say Griezmann. I picked up Griezmann for 31k. It looks like he's rising up a little bit to 40k. So it looks like some people maybe are taking a route of putting in some. Is he 10k? Wow, that's a GG chat. Chat. I call you guys chat. That's a GG though. I bought him at 3.3k and he's 10k. So some of these are, look, they're small wins, but they're big wins at the same time, right? They're they're not the best, but wins are wins. So what this means is, guys, look, a lot of people are coming at me telling me they're gonna do different things for the the other SBC on on Tuesday. Um, they're gonna do the same thing, right? They're gonna require the same shit. So that's what I want to tell you guys. They're gonna require the same exact thing. If you don't think they're gonna require the same thing, you're out of your mind. They're going to require the same thing. I'm telling you right now, guys. Is this dude this high? So he's like 8,000 coins right now. Um, and by the way, guys, uh, let me know in the comments down below. Who did you guys pack? I want to know who you guys got in your packs. Um, I got, so you guys just saw, I got uh, Oblak, I think his name is. So it's not bad. We'll take it. Perrin is at what price? Maybe 6K. So I'm selling the 83s for, for 6K. Hell yeah, I'll sell the 83s. So uh, what else do I want to do today? Um, I want to right now, what I would like to do is I would actually like to go um, with you guys right now and I would like to get on to uh, whether it's footpin let's get on to footpin right because footpin's a way uh, for you guys uh, to come with me and check out what right now is the cheapest uh, what is the cheapest team of the season card did they go up or down today and I thought they were gonna go down 67k so they're at 67k so they actually are the same exact price so a lot of people are gonna ask me should we invest in team of the season cards right now um, I don't know. To be honest, I don't. I don't know. I don't know. To be honest, I don't know how good of a look they are at 70k. I still think that's overpriced. Um, now the reason why they probably they could drop down tonight, but I think they're only up from here. To be honest, um, the reason why they're actually at 70k is that, or maybe those are not updated prices. Let me let me get on the market and check some of these dudes out. So it would be we're looking at like Martinez, Atif. Some of these dudes. Now, the thing with these dudes, guys, is they're going to continue to rise um, because they're better players. And the better the player is, the higher the rated he's going to be and the less discard value he's going to be. So let me see what these dudes are right now. So is he really 70K? So he's starting to come down a little bit now. Look, he's, so he's 70K right now, 69, 68. So I would say for me, a lot of people are wondering, like, when's the time to, to buy? I would say for me, I would buy into these dudes if they go down to the, to the, to the high 50s. High 50s is my is my is my suggested buy price for you guys. If they're if they're not in the high 50s, I don't like it, right? Because they will go up to 80 or 90 on the Tuesday SBC, but you guys want to be making 20 to 30 a card. So I don't I don't really know realistically. And I packed this dude in my rest of the world pack, who does actually look really decent, but I'm not gonna be using him. I don't know if he was the only he's the only so he's the only team the season card I actually had. I wonder if this Iniesta's up. I bought this dude at 63. Is he still really low? So he's still 56. So that's, I mean, that's kind of right now where the market is at. A lot of the players like Suarez um, are starting to rebound because their, their other cards are really high. We've also got some player of the year uh, things going on today. So I'm going to be looking into that. There's a lot of options uh, for player of the year. I don't know exactly who's going to win. That's going to be a really interesting one. I don't know who's going to win player of the year today. I'd, I'd be actually very interested to see who comes home with it. Um, it's going to be interesting. I know I know it's between. It's for the French League, guys. So it's for the Ligue 1. It is between Cavani, uh, Neymar, and Dalvin. So I have one of their informs. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to do it if uh, if the opportunity presents itself. Um, and yeah, so I mean, realistically, I wanted to get on here today and I wanted to buy some cards, but nothing really looks like a buy right now. It doesn't really look like anything's being panic sold. It looks like all the team and season cards are high in value. Um, so nothing right now to me actually looks amazing. I mean, I, to me right now, guys, nothing looks great, um, which is which is kind of annoying. I wish I wish. I wish some of this stuff was actually uh, buyable. I wanted to get on today and buy some cards with you guys. I'm actually a little disappointed. I love, I've actually loved, like, you know, I did a video the other day where we just hopped on and invested. 
I wanted to pick up the panic, but it doesn't really look like there's that much panic right now, which is a little annoying. I wanted to get ready to go and buy some things today. So I think what we'll do is you guys will see um, there may be a video later today. If the market does drop down, we'll uh, we'll we'll definitely we'll definitely do some buying. We'll definitely do some buying because I want to buy want to buy some things and I want to buy with you guys now. I'm probably going to be live streaming uh, during the event today, which is going to be the uh, Young Player of the Year. I'll probably be live streaming during that event. Um, so that is the time uh, in, in where I'll probably be. I might I might record it just so you guys can see what we're doing. I'm rocking right now with a bunch of Mbappes, uh, about 130k. So I'm willing to hold him. I don't know what price he's at. I got it. Let me let me see on the market what price Mbappes at. Let me check that out with you guys real quick. So Mbappes at. Let's check it out. So. I would assume he's probably 170. Oh, little, little Mbappe's up today, huh? So he's 174. Interesting. You know, for me, like, this is such a no risk. This one is such a no risk, this little, this this, this man of the match. Um, because he's always been this price, right? So for me, this man of the match is so low risk. So I'll probably start to pick up some of the man of the match. I'll probably get that one right there. I Oh, my God, yay. Have I, am I still transfer banned? Wow. Can I still not bid on stuff on console? That is a pain in the butt. Can they? Wow. So, guys, I, if you guys don't know, I'm actually, I'm like transfer banned right now because of yesterday I was going through and I was making so many La Liga packs for the live stream. I can't even buy stuff right now. That's kind of depressing. Um, wow. That's kind of sad. Well, anyways, guys, if you enjoyed today's video, uh, smash a like. Again, let me know in the comments down below who did you guys pack in your guaranteed La Liga pack. Um, and yeah, subscribe if you guys are new. Thank you guys for watching today's video, and I'll see you guys in the video soon. Peace out.